time now. It is the manager's report brought to you by Geico. Luke Voigt's home run not only came at an opportune time, but it was an absolute blast. What's the reaction when you see a guy hit one 470 feet? Um, I mean, obviously right away, you know, you know, he got it. So, and obviously in a tie game there, you know, you, you kind of have a outburst of, of emotion there. And then, the, then to see where it ended up, uh, it was quite a blast. 27 home runs since he came over, 13 this year. When you find that kind of gold, what's it like? Um, it's been great. I mean, he's he's brought so much to the table for us. Um, you know, obviously between the lines, he's been really good. Um, he's he's loved coming here and being a Yankee. Um, they love him in that room. He brings something to the park every day, just from an energy standpoint. And uh, we're we're lucky to have him. The Merrifield home run aside, was that man? You've been waiting for it to happen. Man, so good. And, and even the the Merrifield, you know, the pitch. It's a good pitch. I think he kind of just sold out and cheated a little bit up. Um, yeah, I mean, and it looked glad he went six innings and got the win, but it was a dominating effort. I mean, he, his, he had swings and miss all day on the fastball. Um, I thought his, I thought he was just locked in from a focus standpoint, um, getting the ball and executing pitches all day long. And, um, you know, hurt his line a little bit there, but it doesn't take away from what was a great outing from Jay. Knowing the home runs before the game, yeah. is, it, is it bad luck for him? Or uh... Yeah, I mean, sometimes, look, look, the other guy has something to do with it. You know, these, these guys are good, and especially now, more and more guys are able to hit the ball out of the ballpark. And, you know, there's going to be times where... Um, you know, you make a good pitch and a guy gets you. And and I think that was the case there. I got I got to go back and look at it close, but I thought uh, I had no issue with, with the pitch. I thought he got it to where he wanted, and a good hitter clipped him, you know, and that's, you know, that's part of the game sometimes. Those tack on runs even bigger and a doubleheader from Estrada, considering yeah. it saved some of your bullpen. No question. No question to, you know, to, you know, for Sess to come in there and, and, uh, and pitch effectively to be able to stay away from Britt and Al and Chappie in that first game. Um, yeah, that's big. Those, that's why, you know, every little thing matters, you know, in the course of a game, you know. You get some great defensive plays by Gio, and, and uh, you know, those things just, they just add up so much. Will you be using Green in uh, game two? Will yeah. he start? Green will start in game two. Is a chance here? Chance is here. Did you get a chance to talk to Paxton? I did not. Want to avoid what's made him so consistent this season? As he controls his own, yeah. yeah, and he has power. When you control the zone and you have power, that's a dangerous combination. And you know, look, every every hitter is going to go through ebbs and flows and go through some valleys. And you know, Luke does that too, where he gets out of it. But he's able to correct. Usually, when he goes into a little funk for a couple of days, he's usually able to correct. It. And what it comes back to is he ultimately does a really good job of controlling the strike zone. You talked about his energy earlier. What is it about that that's infectious for the rest of that clubhouse? I think since the day he walked in, you know, guys have just taken to him. Um, he's he's comfortable in his own skin. He's uh, you know he's we got a lot of different characters that bring stuff to the room in there and and he's one of them and guys guys love him for it because he he comes to play he works his butt off and and he has a good time doing it as a former third baseman how much do you appreciate Urshel fully seated making that throw man that's the warm bath I talk about see <laughs> he's over there taking a bath today you know it's lazy. I'm like get up get up well okay <laughs> so um yeah, it's it's moving slow for him over there.